Hello, my name is Russell Wright. I'm making this video for my friends over at HealingGrapevine.com that have helped me immensely over the years. I'm not a representative or a staff member. I'm not paid. This is not an endorsement. I'm doing this because I'm passionate about expressing principles in nature that can help heal you regardless of whatever new emerging disease or ailments that you may be experiencing. I brought you to my sacred place because this is a place where the volcanic rocks from Mama Kauai have been hurled out into the ocean in a little micro pier here. I want to tell you a little bit of the story before I get into the crazy, brainy, quantum mechanics behind uh, Far Infrared and why it heals you, why you should zoom in or pay close attention to Far Infrared. These rocks pick up the sun and through radiant heat, between 5 and 50 micron wavelength Far Infrared, they hold the heat. Radiant heat is a bandwidth, uh, far infrared is a bandwidth on the electromagnetic spectrum. Electromagnetic spectrum includes everything from giant waves like radio waves to very small waves in high frequency and amplitude and different amplitude waves. You don't have to understand what all that means, but just know that nature has been using, far, has been emitting radiant heat in all different kinds of ways. If it's alive, you're radiating far infrared from 50 to 5 to 50 microns. The healing range of far infrared is somewhere between 7 and 14. I also want to thank the people at MPS Global that actually uh, have the most stable far infrared, infrared product using carbon uh, filaments in order to hold the stable 7.5 to 14 micron wavelengths. So the bottom line is that if your body stops emitting heat, you're dead. The, more, the colder you get, the deader you get. Your body's ability to hold charge through compression, if you're holding charge, which is what health is, you're emitting heat. And a healthy body is emitting heat at a specific range. The reason that the Hawaiian culture uses stones and heats the stones for lomi lomi is, and puts them on the spine is because that resonant heat and resonant absorption helps the body find its own core far infrared temperature and stabilize it. You got to stabilize your, your core far infrared because that's the definition of health. So you can go find a spot on the beach and find these black rocks. I used to come out here every day for weeks thinking I was dying when I was experiencing my super Lyme symptoms. Gradually, through swimming in the salt water, salt is a huge component as well, and lying on these hot rocks, my body started to penetrate, was penetrated by far infrared bandwidth, and it was also emanating out of these stones into my spine when I backed, when I laid on my back on these things. Now, this is not available to everyone, obviously. Not everybody lives in the beautiful island of Kauai or has volcanic rocks, but you can lie in the sun as long as you protect your skin. Some people who are experiencing more gallons and limes can't go out in the sun because they're experiencing sun resistance type symptoms like a lupus patient or a porphyria patient. It has to do with your liver. This is why other doctors who are actively and openly treating the symptoms of things like super limes and, and more gallons are teaching far infrared and using far infrared because it doesn't emit any light bandwidths of ultraviolet, which is higher up the electromagnetic spectrum, but only through, a, through resonant absorption allows the body to reabsorb the natural life charge holding heat that is supposed to be your birthright. When you're born, when a baby is born, their natural resonant heat is between 7 and 14 microns wavelength. This is very important uh, to understand. And not to get too cosmic, Dr. Staniger and others have pointed out that the birth of the star happens in the, in the infrared band, band width ranges. Whether you're dealing with uh, near, mid, or far infrared bandwidths, you're dealing with a very special range of resonant absorption, the ability to absorb the baseline heat, the, the, the heat range of the body that is the homeostatic heat range for health. And it's right there in the far infrared range. Some of the mythology about far infrared will be emerging over the next couple of years as we have a scientific basis for understanding healing modalities within that range of the electromagnetic spectrum. For example, we know that in Chinese medicine, 
healers who have healing hands have a heat radiating from their hand between four and eight microns range. You can use far infrared pads, and there are hundreds of companies that are selling different kinds of far infrared pads that lead, you know, that will give you specific range. I'm not here to compete with those brands. I got to say that the difference between those ceramic and toxic filament type brands that you can buy for 50 or 100 dollars is that they do leak toxic xenoestrogens and the rest because they're heating up the heat elements. They also don't have a, uh, a kind of coherent heat that stays stable within the 7 to 10, 7 to 14 micron range. It's actually quite difficult when I began to study the science to keep the far infrared emitting right in that healing range. This, for example, is uh, one of the heating pads that is offered by Healing Grapevine that uses the, car the proprietary carbon, L carbon, uh, proprietary carbon technology that allows a stable heterodyne in the far infrared range between 7 and 14. It's very different than ceramic, which is unpredictable because it's all kind of all over the map when you're in the lab trying to see if it's going to stay between 7 to 14. You might even go up to 20 or 30. So there's a lot to learn about far infrared and not every technology is the same. Although I'm talking to you about a product, I want to emphasize that radiant heat that is getting your body warm helps detox nanotoxic material as well as other kinds of lateral gene transfer material, as well as I've had huge success using far infrared to detoxify the body from nematodes and nematode infection. So I want to express a huge gratitude for Mama Kauai, this beautiful island that is radiating out of her very being, surrounded by this volcanic energy that she spit out of her volcano thousands of years ago that automatically absorbs resonant heat that gave me the gift of being able to lie in these rocks and get my body tuned back into the natural healing 7 to 14 far infrared bandwidth wavelength. I'd like to invite you, if you don't have this kind of a beneficial environment, to find a place where you can actually get sun, reabsorb that heat, and if not, if you can't afford a sauna from MPS Global, first of all, I'd recommend that you only buy the far infrared pads from MPS Global, not because I'm trying to sell you anything, not because I actually make money from that company because I don't work for it, but because in my research uh, for my nonprofit organizations, it's the only far infrared pads I recommend because it's the only one that stays stable within those ranges. You can order those at healinggrapevine.com. I would also ask that you pay more attention to what's going on in your body. Learn how the heat is absorbed, absorbed in your body. Study radiant heat and get your body, if your body is sick, you have simply lost the ability to generate heat and compression of heat from your core. You can get that back through exercise and at night when you cool down the most, you can turn on a far infrared pad and retrain your body to resonate through resonant absorption the 7 to 14 micron range. My name is Russell Wright and I, I wish for your help with all my heart. Um, please pay attention to recent up, to upcoming updates on the healinggrapevine.com and we'll keep you informed of new and emerging technologies that bring the healing elements of the electromagnetic spectrum directly to you and to your body.